happened at Lake Brantley High School in Altamont Springs. New 6's Amanda Castro is live at the school tonight. And Amanda, a separate incident after this drill caused even more trouble inside the school. Yeah, Lisa, it was a crazy day for the students out here. Within the past 30 minutes, I just got an update from the Seminole County School District. They say that a student pulled a prank in the cafeteria today, showing a message on social media that trick to trick students into thinking that there was a real threat, a real shooter on campus. It did seem totally real. Honestly. Lake Brantley High School student McKay Rosalo said he heard what sounded like gunshots coming from the cafeteria today. Seminole County Schools telling News 6 a student showed classmates this notification teachers got from an unannounced code red drill earlier in the day, saying there was an active shooter on campus, sending students running, fearing for their lives. Everyone was booking it. It was just, there was no one, no one was walking. I could say that. We, we jumped fences and stuff like that. A friend of mine almost twisted his ankle. Yeah, everyone was running in the cafeteria. People were just getting trampled because of that. So a friend of mine, he fell and it was, it was just, it was chaos. That unannounced code red drill happened around 1021 this morning and was unrelated to the cafeteria incident. No one, including parents, teachers, administrators or students knew it was happening. Teachers and students locking themselves inside their classrooms, later learning it was just a drill. Parents found out about the drill about an hour later on the high school's Facebook page. Many outraged, saying the district shouldn't scare the students and this should have been handled better. And right before a live shot, I just got off the phone with the Seminole County School District again. They told me that student got a copy of that notification from the code red drill by taking a picture from a teacher's either phone or computer a teacher who gets that alert, which is not policy. So that is something that the school district is now going to look into to see if that's what happened here and how they can make sure that doesn't happen again. The school district telling us this was a planned unannounced drill. They purposely didn't didn't tell anyone about it because they want to make sure students and teachers react to the situation as real as possible. But you saw parents still upset about that. Of course, we're working to gather more information and we'll keep you posted as soon as we learn any new details on air and online at clickorlando.com. Lisa. Amanda Castro reporting live for us tonight. Thank you.